realize how bad this was until now. Oh my god. <laughs> If my hair looks crazy, I'm so, so sorry. I've been trying my best to get it to look proper, but this is just about to be a real informal, cute, quick video. I know someone did ask for me to do a shoe collection, but I'm just waiting till Christmas because I feel like I'm about to get some great shoes. So after Christmas, I will show you guys like everything that I got for Christmas and also my shoe collection video. But first and foremost, I want to show you guys my bag collection. Um, I feel as though it's it's gotten out of hand. It's getting a little scary how many bags I have. Um, and I still feel like sometimes I need more to go with certain outfits. But this video will be a bag collection and also like how I've styled these bags before. And I'll insert just some pictures on the side of how I, you know, finessed it, jazzed it up. I really used to be a girl that didn't like accessories at all. Um, like literally I don't wear rings. I just wear like my little studs and also my name necklace that's all the jewelry that I wear but when it comes down to my bags like oh and sunglasses but <laughs> it's not summertime anymore but when it comes down to bags like I always have a bag in my picture like I have to have a bag that completes the outfit I just feel like an outfit is never complete without the bag okay so without further ado we're just gonna get straight into this video don't forget to subscribe because we are on the road to 10 Okay. But I also wanted to film this video because I finally, finally got my Telfars in the mail today. It's been a long time coming. I pre-ordered them back in August, so I'm just going to show you guys which ones that I got. And I'm so excited. So excited. We are going to try our best not to make this video long because I have a lot of bags. We're just going to try and speed through this, but this is the box that it came in. I got too many ones, too many girls, so... This would make it four Telfars that I have in total. So, yeah, like I said, like, I OD'd. So, it comes in this dust bag. Ooh, it's so cute. It's a final reveal. Oh, I gotta make a TikTok. A Telfeezy. I'm a Telfeezy. Mercy, what you just got in the mail? A Telfeezy. A Telfeezy, bitch. A Telfeezy. A Telfeezy, easy, but breezy. I do these dirty bum bitches real greasy. I do these dirty bum bitches real greasy. I do these dirty bum bitches real greasy. <laughs> I got the orange one. <laughs> I am so excited. Let me take this um this tape off because I do want the the handles to be stretched out. So I'm gonna take pictures tomorrow with this. But oh, she's everything that I dreamed of. She's just the mini one. It has the clasp in it, and I'll put the links to every purse. I can find the link under in the description. So don't forget to check the description. But she's just this bright orange number. Y'all not ready. I'm not even ready. But y'all definitely not ready. Okay. Moving on. So the next bag that we have. Ah, she's so cute. Since I ordered it back in August, it was closer to when it was warm outside. So this bag color made a whole lot more sense. But it's just this pink. I don't know if the lighting is going to mess it up or not. But it's just this pink one. And it has the same Telfar logo and all that good stuff. It's a mini one. It's like the other one. And these are the only luxury bags that I own. Um, cause Telfar is a black owned luxury brand if you guys did not know. I don't have any Gucci or Louis or Chanel or Prada, we not there yet, but one day. <laughs> and while we are on the topic of Telfars, this big body black Telfar bag, I use this when I travel, um, use it as an overnight bag. This bag has literally saved my life multiple times, so I am in absolute love with it. And I already showed it in my black owned business haul, so if you haven't checked that out already, you guys can go check that out as well. And last but not least, for my Telfeezy, easy but breezy gang, have this white Telfar. She is my absolute fave i feel like i take so many pictures with her i've styled her so many different ways she's going to mess with the lighting but it has the same telfar t logo in the middle and i like this girl is my holy grail like this is my go-to the medium one to this and a medium one to the black and we set and then i might not buy no more maybe the red but <laughs> so the next bag that I have, I got two of them, and they're from the same brand. They're called Nana Nana, and I'll put their Instagram down below. It's just this a bag, and it's part of their A5 series. Um, they have different numbers of different bags, like you know how Christian Dior has D-Way and 
all the other stuff, whatever. So A5 is one of their style of bags, and it's just this PVC bag, and it has their logo down here. It says Nana Nana, and it's transparent, like you can see through it. And I'll show you guys how I styled this. I brought this to the beach, and here is the other one. I have not gotten to wear her yet. So sad, because she's so cute. A lot of these bags I have not worn yet. They just literally, I've been waiting for the right outfit, the right moment. So we're going to see a lot of that. Just this cream color. It's not as transparent as the other one um but it is still a little bit see-through and it's also part of their a5 series and it also has the nana nana logo at the bottom these straps are also detachable and you can also wear it as a handbag and this is a dupe for like the balenciaga shopping bags if you guys have ever seen that um but i did mention that in my black owned business haul as well so this bag is a fanny pack and it's just this croc embossed fanny pack with a belt loop it's a little too big for me but it just has this gold clasping that is super hard to open but i will show you guys how i styled this bag on the side this is perfect for jumpsuits because you guys know jumpsuits don't have pockets so definitely highly 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 recommend something like this if you're someone that likes to wear jumpsuits like me so the next bag that i have i got this from misguided i'm almost a thousand percent sure they do not have this on their website anymore because misguided accessories sell out so fast it's ridiculous but it's just this what is this a dupe for i think gucci i think this is a dupe for like a gucci bag like the print is giving very gucci I think I hope that's the right brand that I'm thinking of right now but it's just this brown tan bag and the clasping is also really nice and you just twist it and then it pops open and then you close it and then you just twist it and then it closes I'll show you guys how I style this on the side as well cuz honey love her <laughs> this bag is a brand spanking new as you can see the tag is still on it I got it from pretty little thing and I just thought it was so cute with the graphic painting letters here it gives very artiste and it's just this navy blue and the paint is kind of like cream colored so I think this would look really nice with a cream dress I have a perfect Zara dress for this but I already wore that dress so <laughs> oops but um if I ever do wear it again I will pair with this right, bag so this bag when I first started my little fashion journey or whatever, this was my girl. This is my go-to. I have styled her in so many different ways. I got her from Shein, and it's just this leather. It's a really good quality. It's just this leather baguette bag. Has these gold, um, gold hardware on the side, and it's very spacious on the inside, and it has this thick strap. But I love her. She is like literally a staple. A practically a basic in my bag collection like I feel like everyone should have like a basic simple black baguette bag so the next bag that we have is just this other white baguette bag it's actually a cream color I don't know what it is about this bag that doesn't make me gravitate towards it as much as the white one but it is croc emboss I don't know if the lighting is showing that but it is and I don't know I just don't gravitate towards this bag as much as you would think I do I do have a lot of outfits that will go with this but I don't know what it is about it maybe it's just too big like the bag here is just too big if this was like a little bit smaller I would gravitate towards this a little bit more so this next bag I got it from Shein too I get a lot of my bags from Shein because they're so inexpensive and five times out of ten you're gonna get something that's really good quality and you'll see that later in this video but it's just this tweed bag and it just has this leather strap this one is one of the ones that are on the cheaper side not gonna lie but um it has this gold chain here and here is what the tweet looks like the tweet is not as prominent as i thought it was going to be but it is still really really cute and you can wear this with like a preppy outfit like an all black preppy outfit and i'll show you guys how i styled it on this side all right so this next bag is something that i also wear a lot um but now that i have my white tail far i feel like i have drifted away from her but i got this from she in too and just this white baguette bag see now i like this one a little bit more than the other one that i showed you guys because this one is a pure white the other one is a cream white um but, but it's also croc embossed as well i don't know if you guys can tell but it's croc embossed and it's a shiny leather material you have to stuff her because if i don't she just looks really bad in pictures girls my fuzzy purses i don't know this trend i hope it never dies because i really do love fuzzy bags so this is the first one and it's just this gray fuzzy bag and it has like this ruching detail right here and also a pom-pom and it also has a furry handle i think it did come with like a regular handle but i like the furry handle better <laughs> 
um, and I just styled this with like an all black outfit for like running errands. And, and the next one that I got, I just recently got this and I will be showing it in an upcoming Shein haul. So don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on that. But it's just this black bag and it has a, this a big furry pouch at the end. It's so soft. It's so big. Running errands. I think this is casual. I don't care what nobody say. If I see somebody with something fuzzy, I'm going to think this casual. And last but not least, we just have this cream fuzzy bag. I also got this from Shein. This one is one of those ones that are on the cheaper side, so be careful. But it is really, really nice. This will go great with an all-black outfit. Y'all know me. It's just all-black for me. It's not as big as my other bags that I just showed you. Now, this bag was made so well. I got this from Fashion Nova. The quality is actually out of this world. Like... Honestly, really, really love her, and I'll show you guys how I styled her on the side. It does button here, but you can unclasp it, and then it opens up, and then on the inside, it's just this red color. It's just so well made. Like, the quality is so good for this bag. So, like, here's the next bag. Also, will be featured in my Shein haul coming soon, um, but it's just this Louis Vuitton print dupe um, shoulder bag, and it comes with this gold chain. I think it also came with, like, a longer gold chain, but I would definitely wear this as a shoulder bag anyway. I haven't gotten the chance to style it, but I'm really excited to because I really, really do love this bag, and I love the gold chain. I feel like it's really in, and it makes everything look very very luxe so the next bag that I have is just this ruche bag now she's not a fave of mine I actually think I might end up selling this so if you don't follow me on my Poshmark I would suggest heading over there if you enjoy this bag it did come stuff like I really have not worn it much um I just don't know how I feel about it it does come with the crossbody the crossbody isn't that long either um but it is a clutch and it just has this metal clasping and it's it's cute, but she's just really not my vibe. I haven't found anything to go with her yet. So, I mean, I'll just keep her around. She's just not every bit of me, you know? Yeah. Here is another one of my faves. It's this Givenchy dupe. Givenchy, whatever. Whatever. Once I can afford it, I'll be able to pronounce it properly. But it's just this dupe of a Givenchy bag. And it's a black and it has gold hardware. And I got this from Miss Guided. Like I said, I don't know if Miss Guided will still have this because they do sell out of things extremely fast for what reason i don't know but it is really well made nice quality love the handles love the crossbody the crossbody is detachable and i'll show you guys how i styled this on the side but i do highly highly recommend her because i do love her and like i said black bags are such a good staple to have in your closet if you want to amp up your purse collection I have had this bag for so, so long. Um, I had it since I was in college, but it's just this clear bag with these gold details on it. I got it from Shein, and I've styled this multiple times. I love this for when you're wearing an outfit and you just don't have a color, like, don't have a colored bag in mind that you think would go good. Like, literally just grab this. But like literally if you're having trouble grab a clear bag this like, next bag is new i haven't even gotten to wear her yet but she is just so cute just has this gold chain kind of similar to the other bag that i showed you guys and it still has the similar louis vuitton print um i got this from Shein, and it also has like this gold bar here i think all the gold accents make makes it look very luxe and it's like this paper bag like tissue box kind of style and literally you open it up and that's what it looks like on the inside and and then these little strings on the side closes it and love this and then at the end of the strings it also does have like the matching print to this which i think is such a cute detail to add and the next bag that i have i have not found anything to wear with this yet either i have not gotten the chance to style this but i have had it in my collection for a while it's just this tan um square trapezoidy kind of bag it does have this gold crossbody i don't know why i haven't grabbed this yet i feel like i will soon um because it is something that will go with a lot of things i just haven't had any ideas spark me like oh i need that bag the next bag that i have is just this cylinder bag has this gold accents on it and then also does have a crossbody but the crossbody is detachable and you can just wear it like this which i think i will do i have not gotten the chance to wear this yet i do have an outfit in mind so don't worry make sure you follow me on my socials if you want to see how that turns out but it is really nice and it's really spacious i'm pretty sure i stuffed this is this where all my fuzzy socks went oh no oh yeah it is 
I was looking for my fuzzy socks in my purse. Stuff this so I can get its shape and hold its shape. But it does come with this gold crossbody and has this black accent at the top. Still don't know how I feel about it. I just feel like if it was just like this, like the gold chain, it would look way nicer. So the like, next bag that I have is this straw bag. I actually got it from Shein. This is one of the ones that are on the cheaper side. I thought it was going to be a little bit more high quality but it is not. But this is perfect for the summertime and I will show you guys how I styled this bag. I styled it a long time ago. I've had this bag for a while. Um, I actually might sell this so <laughs> yeah don't know if I'm going to keep her because I did have to like patch her up and make her look better but yeah, she was cute for the time being. It's just a straw bag. Nothing too crazy here either. Next, we have this bag. See, I loved her for the outfit that I wore her with, but I just don't like her. Like, <laughs> she was cute for the pics, but I just am not a fan. Like, I'm really going to give, like, I'm going to sell this one because I don't like it as much as I thought I would. It's just maybe so, it's just the shape or the clasping. I just don't know what it is. But if you do enjoy this bag and you do like this bag, I will be selling it. So the next bag that I have is just this pink bag. It's a super pink, like bright pink. And I do have a couple outfits that I could wear with this. Um, but I... Like, I haven't worn this. this my DR recreation video, I got a couple different pink purses. Really bright pink. Like, you can tell. Like, the pink is vibrant right now. And I don't mind her at all. So, I'm going to keep her. But definitely something way out of my comfort zone. Alright. So, the next bag that I have is just a Prada dupe. I haven't worn this yet. Only for the simple fact that I do plan on getting a Prada bag soon. So, I, I don't know. I just feel like... I want the real thing. I want the real thing. So I haven't been able to wear this, but I will show you guys how I styled it because I did actually style this bag. Color is just too adorable. Too adorable. I loved her when I got her. Like, are you dumb? Like, this is everything. So this next bag, I love her. Like, I feel like I've gotten so such good use out of this tiny little bag. It's just this bright neon green with a gold chain. I got it from Shein, and I wore it with like this gold, this neon green bathing suit. Um, and I also wore it with this white and black outfit. And the neon green really like makes it like gives it some color because whenever you wear a lot of white and black, you always want to find something to spice it up. And neons, reds are like great ways to like make the outfit pop even though the outfit is just white and black you know so this next bag is just this super sparkly 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 bag i love stuff like this this is perfect for birthdays i wore this on my birthday and i'll show you guys how i styled it i got it from steve madden so it was pretty expensive and i'm sure you can find something cheaper online but i could not i literally could not find anything online similar to this like this kind of style um and fast enough to get in time for my birthday but it's just this super sparkly clutch you can put the chain inside you can also wear it as a crossbody and it came with matching shoes and i'll link both of those things down below so this next bag i also loved it loved it loved it when i first got it i just think it's so it's such a statement bag it's just all these different denim patches on it and it is a crossbody and the crossbody is like blue and then this dark navy blue color and I love her but I just I think it's time for us to part ways like I just feel like I can I can find something that's similar to this and makes a larger statement I don't know I just feel like this is just like my little ease into fashion you know like I feel like I can do so much better you know so this next bag I love this bag I have not gotten the chance to style this yet but I freaking love her she is such a good summer bag like I can't wait to wear her and it comes with this gold chain and I feel like I would wear it with the gold chain but it also does come with this gold this brown crossbody and I love this bag like I just think it's it's very well made high quality so it's one of those Shein bags where like you got lucky um and it's this brown color and I just can't wait like perfect summer bag perfect summer bag these next two bags i'm gonna show together because these are so cute they're like my favorite tiny little bags i have not gotten to style them yet and i'm so sad but i'm so glad i had them in my collection anyway brown and white louis vuitton dupe mini bags they did come with a gold chain but i don't see why i would be crossing these across my body like i just don't i just don't see it but um i do like the little handle i just think the handle is so adorable so cute so girly she is a fave she is a fave so it's just this brick red brown color box bag i wore this to death in the summer i'll show you guys how i styled this on the side i freaking love this bag she is so cute she's every bit of me and you can detach this i love the clear strap i don't know it might be the clear strap for me 
So next we have another pink bag. Like I said, I got a lot of pink bags before I did my DR recreation, which I will link in the cards on the screen. Pink looks so good on brown skin, so I'm probably not going to give this away. But I just love, 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 love. Love her. So this next bag is just a red bag. It's just a red mini bag. I got this off of Shein. I remember this bag being dumb expensive for this tiny little thing. Like, I can't even fit my phone in here. I don't even know what could fit in here. Barely a lip gloss. Like, you know I only use these bags for accessories when the dang on tissue is still in it so like you already know i only use this for pictures but i will show you guys how i styled this red bag i love this red bag to death it's such a good pop of color and i kind of want the red telfar bag but they be playing with shipping like so i don't even know i think i might just hold off until they get it together i do find myself gravitating towards this bag a lot so definitely highly recommend getting this bag if you had your eyes on something nice and red right. and last but not least we just have this bag i swore up and down up and down i was never gonna get a bag like this it just sets a basketball on it and it has this crossbody and then this gold chain i don't think i will wear it with the crossbody simply because i think without it it looks so cute but i got it to wear for a specific outfit so like i said if you don't follow me on my instagram you're not gonna be able to see it. you're not gonna be able to see the vibes like what kind of vibes i was given with this bag but i've always seen this bag on she and and I was like, you know, I'm not going to buy this. Like, why would I ever buy it? But I had the perfect outfit in mind when I saw it. So I was like, you know, I'm just going to get it. And you guys will see how I style it later. But I do love this bag. And it's really well made. Like, like I said, one of those ones where you got lucky. And this is that. This is that. <laughs> the aftermath <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning into this video i know it's probably pretty long but i really do enjoy purses i do enjoy bags and i hopefully found a group of people that loves them just as much as me that watch this video and if you stuck around to the end i am so appreciative of you do not forget to hit that subscribe button if you like what you see don't forget to follow me on my socials and more content coming soon be on the lookout thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye